and you may not want to believe in imaginary numbers like the kitty over here, but we're going to because they really exist even though they're called imaginary. Um, you need to be able to set up your calculator to work with complex numbers, that's what we call them now. And so the way you do this is to watch the cursor and do what I do, go to mode and you'll see this screen and then using the down arrow key come down to where real is highlighted the word real now it's blinking now you need to go to your right arrow key and click on the right arrow key so that A plus BI is covered then come down to enter and click on enter now your calculator is all set up to work with complex numbers. Let's do one, okay? All right, I am going to click second mode and that will bring me back to the screen. Um, also, your I letter for imaginary is located here above the dot. So we've already talked about what imaginary numbers are and how they were discovered. Now we're going to actually work with them. Um, I am going to add two complex numbers. How about 3 plus 2? Now I need to put an I, and the way I get an I is I push the second key and I push the decimal point key. And now I have 3 plus 2I. Now if I want to, and I do, I can add this first complex number. I can add the first complex number, which is 3 plus 2i, to any other complex number. How about 5 minus 7i? So 5 minus 7, and then i is second dot. Wow, I'm ready to add. Let's hit Enter. And there's my answer. 8 minus 5i. Now, while we're at it, why don't we subtract? Why don't I say 3 plus 2i, which is second dot. I'm going to subtract, but I have to use parentheses when I subtract. So minus 5 minus 7i and then I'll close the parentheses. Now I hit enter and there's your answer, negative 2 plus 9i. We always put what's called the real part, the real number in front and the, the imaginary number behind. In fact this part is called the real part and this part is called the imaginary part. Okay, while we're at it, let's multiply going to say parentheses 3 plus 2 I parentheses closed then open parentheses 5 minus 7 I and close my parentheses I'm going to multiply my two complex numbers 3 plus 2i is one of the complex numbers, and 5 minus 7i is another complex number. I'm going to multiply them. If I were doing this by hand, I would have to um, FOIL, but now all I have to do is hit ENTER. And there you have it. We've added, subtracted, and multiplied complex numbers. The next video, we're going to divide.